Hello, Larry. This is Baron Baptiste, and happy, happy 35th anniversary of your work and your contribution to the world. It's uh, been really an amazing uh, process to get to watch and observe and feel uh, the impact of all your tremendous work in the world. It's really exciting that you're partnering with Pondicheet School in West Africa and the amazing work there. And uh, wow, you and I go so far back. I, um, I remember back in the mid or late 1980s when Yoga Journal Magazine had their first PR conference. All the media was there and uh, you brought Indra Devi to that event who is like a godmother to me. I brought China Phillips to the event and uh, that was a long time ago. And and yet those memories still live so uh, vividly in my mind and heart and uh, in getting to share those experiences with you. I, um, you know, I, I'm at my home here in, in Park City, Utah, and uh, surrounded by beautiful mountains and, and just the simplicity of uh, life here. And, um, and when I, you know, look out into the mountains or get the opportunity to hike out, I'm always reminded of a lesson um, in, in yoga practice, it's been passed down to me um, through my teachers and including my parents, which is to observe through the eyes of samadhi. Um, and to me, the interpretation of that is to see through uh, a clear lens, to see things as they are, as the great yoga master Sri uh, Yukteswar said, Wisdom is the ability to see things as they are. And so um, for many years, it's been my practice of, you know, when, when something happens in my life, I have some experience, some, whether it's a challenge or something in a yoga asana or in meditation, when I get something, some experience, something happens, and I see in that moment, I have the opportunity to see that situation through a, a clear lens to observe, to the observer, the witness uh, from, from no thing, uh, an uncolored witnessing of whatever's happening before I launch into just giving the situation meaning. Uh, whatever that happened or is happening, the, my typical mind will just give it all meaning and interpretation and uh, the ability to step back into more of a meditation uh, space of witness and to see things as they are, the wisdom of th seeing things as they are, and then having choice in what meaning I give to the situation and, and choosing the more enlightened uh, view or interpretation or meaning uh, rather than sometimes the mind goes right into, you know, um, a limiting or disempowering uh, context or interpretation. So, the wisdom of being able to just see things as they are and to choose my view and, and the meaning in which I, um, yeah, give to the, to the thing. Okay, that's it. Much love uh, from my heart to yours. Uh, namaste and happy, happy 35th anniversary, Larry Payne.